wheel is the mother of all inventions. But ever since humans started inventing, they have never looked back. From bleeding edge communication to uncovering secrets of space, we present you with 10 emerging future technologies that will change the world. Floating farms. A floating farm is an agricultural system developed and operated on a water body like an ocean, a lake, or river. This phenomenon is also known as floating agriculture, aquatic agriculture, and aquaculture. Floating farms provide a sustainable solution to food insecurity and environmental degradation by utilizing unused water resources. They typically involve the cultivation of crops and animal husbandry, including fish, shellfish, and other aquatic species. In addition, they often include hydroponics and aquaponics systems, which involve growing plants in nutrient-rich water and creating a symbiotic relationship between fish and plants. Floating farms are also used for recreational purposes, such as fishing, swimming, and boating. The benefit spectrum of floating farms is broad, including increased food security, improved water quality, and reduced pollution. Additionally, they are highly efficient and cost-effective and can grow various crops with minimal resources. So, conclusively, floating farms offer a unique and sustainable solution to many of the world's food production challenges. Spin Launch Spin Launch is an innovative new technology which uses centrifugal force to propel a rocket into space. The technology works by spinning a rocket into a central axis, building up a large amount of centrifugal force. This force is then used to launch the rocket into space. The technology has been developed over several years and tested with a scaled model in a wind tunnel. Spin Launch has several advantages over traditional rocket launches. Firstly, it is much cheaper as it does not require large amounts of fuel and thus can be used to launch smaller payloads. Secondly, the launch is much safer as the rockets are launched at low speeds and with a low risk of explosion. Spin Launch is an enabling new technology which has the potential to revolutionize space travel as it is cheaper, safer, and more cost-efficient than traditional rocket launches. Edge Computing Edge Computing is a distributed computing model which allows data, computing, storage, and applications to be processed near the edge of the network closer to the source of the data. Edge Computing is gaining traction due to the increased demand for low latency and cost-effective solutions. By bringing computing closer to the data source, Edge computing can reduce latency, minimize bandwidth consumption, and increase privacy as data does not have to be sent to distant cloud-based servers. Autonomous vehicles use edge computing to process and analyze sensor data in real time to make decisions. Medical imaging can benefit from edge computing to provide low-latency image analysis and reduce the burden on healthcare systems. Smart home devices can leverage edge computing to process data quickly and respond to user requests. Current limitations of edge computing include the need for expensive, high-performance hardware and limited scalability. Edge computing also relies on a robust internet connection, making it challenging to deploy in remote or low connectivity areas. Additionally, the distributed nature of edge computing can be challenging to manage and maintain. No wonder why there are only three players in the market, that is, Amazon, Microsoft, and IBM. While Amazon rules over 47% of the cloud computing infrastructure and service. Connected Homes Connected homes are equipped with IoT devices that can be controlled remotely. This technology allows homeowners to manage their home environment from any location. Connected homes enable homeowners to control lighting, heating, and other appliances from their smartphones. They can also monitor and manage security systems, set alarms and thermostats, and even monitor energy usage. More like modern-day EVs, you can control everything about your car from the outside, so everything is according to your will upon entering. Connected homes provide a level of convenience that is not available in traditional homes. GPT-3 GPT-3 is an advanced natural language processing algorithm created by OpenAI. It stands for Generative Pre-Trained Transformer 3. GPT-3 is a powerful artificial intelligence model trained on a large corpus of text data and can generate human-like text. It can generate text 
complete tasks and answer questions without being explicitly programmed. It can revolutionize how we communicate with machines and help us develop more intelligent computer systems. GPT-3 is a step towards a more natural and intuitive way of interacting with computers and will undoubtedly play an essential role in the future of AI. Quantum Computing Quantum computing is a revolutionary technology that seeks to revolutionize how we view computing. It is based on the principles of quantum mechanics and uses the unique properties of quantum bits, dubbed as qubits, to process information. Unlike traditional computers, quantum computers can process information much faster and can be used to solve complex problems that are not possible with conventional computers. Quantum computing is used for various applications such as artificial intelligence, cryptography, and drug discovery. However, quantum computing is still in its infancy, and its limitations include scalability, noise, decoherence, and error correction. As of now, quantum computers are not yet able to operate on a large scale and are limited to a relatively small number of qubits. Additionally, noise and decoherence caused by external interference can disrupt the qubits and lead to errors in the calculation process. 3D Printing 3D printing is becoming a popular technology for building houses. It is a type of additive manufacturing that involves printing out a house layer by layer from a digital 3D model. 3D printing has several advantages compared to traditional construction methods, including reduced labor costs, faster construction time, and improved accuracy. The conventional construction of a house requires a large team of skilled workers, materials, and expensive machinery, which make the cost of a traditionally built home very high. 3D printing makes the construction process automated and much faster than the traditional construction, reducing labor costs and eliminating the need for expensive machinery. 3D printed houses typically cost around $20,000 to $25,000 while a usually made place can range anywhere from $100,000 to $500,000. Additionally, 3D printed houses are more environmentally friendly since they require fewer materials and generate less construction waste. Lastly, the accuracy of 3D printing ensures that the finished product is of high quality. Graphene Graphene is a single atom thick layer of carbon atoms arranged in a hexagonal lattice. It is one of the strongest and thinnest materials and has many potential applications. Graphene is incredibly light and flexible, yet extremely strong and durable. It is also a good conductor of electricity and heat and can be used to create transparent conducting materials. Its potential applications include electronics, optoelectronics, photonics, sensors, and energy storage and conversion. In addition, it can be used to create flexible displays and transparent conductors, improve solar cell efficiency, and develop efficient batteries. Furthermore, much more efficient filtration membranes and substantially lighter materials can be manufactured by using graphene. Research is ongoing to exploit its potential to be used as a drug delivery system and for its potential to revolutionize medical imaging technology. Firefighting via water Considering the climatic change and overwhelmingly increasing wildfire incidents, the sound is being used as a substitute for fighting fires due to its ability to generate significant oxygen pressure. The sound wave can be directed at the fire using sound pressure waves and acoustic waves amplified by specialized equipment. This method is believed to be more effective than traditional firefighting methods as it eliminates the need for water and foam. The sound wave can also be more precise than conventional firefighting techniques, as it can be adjusted to fit the size and shape of the fire. This new technique of fighting fire with sound has been tested in a laboratory setting, and the results were promising. The sound waves were able to extinguish the fire quickly and efficiently. However, this technique has yet to be used in a real-life situation. The main issue with this technique is the cost. The equipment is expensive and can only be used by specially trained personnel. The cost of the equipment and training may be too much for some fire departments to adopt as soon as it is in its final working shape. Underwater bridges The challenge is immense and the stakes are high. Building underwater bridges is a monumental undertaking, requiring the most advanced engineering and construction techniques. But with the right skills and equipment, 
it is possible to connect two otherwise isolated worlds. The prospect of building an underwater bridge is thrilling, as it demands an awe-inspiring feat of human ingenuity that would break through the waves and unlock new possibilities. Challenges abound, but with enough grit and determination, engineers could open a new realm of options and bridge the gap between two oceans. Underwater bridges are built using a variety of techniques and materials. Depending on a project, specific procedures may be more suitable than others. The most common method for underwater bridges involves using precast concrete elements, which are placed together and secured with steel rods. This method is often used for larger scale projects, as it can withstand strong currents and other environmental factors. To ensure the bridge is watertight and stable, an impermeable sealant is applied to the elements before they are placed together. Additionally, the elements are sealed together using a combination of grout, mortar, and steel reinforcement. Finally, it is often anchored to the underlying seabed to ensure stability. Now that we have shared all the technologies up our sleeves, it is time for us to sign off. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We will catch you in the next video.